Hayden's house. And we're back in England. And tonight we're having fish and chips. And Knicker Bonker Glory for dessert. So, let's get to it. it. <sighs> Nate's killing the potatoes for the chips. How's it going? Very peely. Bigger chunks than what you normally do. That was super rude. We're cutting them up into bigger chunks than you would normally cut fries up into because they're chips, they're not fries. So we're cutting them a little thicker than normal. Yeah. All right, we're getting if the I do, you ready only to cook. cook. The kids are gonna help with that. We actually uh, picked out some flounder. Uh, it smells bad. They're really not excited about fish, but hey, that. gotta try new things, right, Nate? That's right. Okay, now we're gonna season them a little bit with salt and pepper. Just a little bit, though, because you don't like pepper. Do you like pepper? But she loves salt. Everybody loves salt. So we just cover them in flour and then bread them? Yep, we want to cover them in flour so that the batter will stick to them. The kids measuring out the seasoning for the beer battered fish. And Nate's about to put the chips into the frying pan. And I'm going to get the beer for our beer battered fish. Don't know if you guys have followed along in some of our other vlogs, but Nate actually brews his own beer. So we are going to use his light ale. Okay, Nate's working on taking some of them out. The recipe we found said to fry them for a bit, then put them in a bowl that you could cover and let them steam so they cook in the middle a little more and then fry them again to really brown them. So that's what we're going to try to make sure the middles are cooked well and the last batch is going in the oil. So while we're working on dinner for our dessert, we needed to make some whipped cream so the kids are getting started on that. And take some time to make that up. I'm about to get the ear batter going for the fish. Lumpy and it's like the consistency of a pancake. Need more. Just wait. We just mixed up a little bit more. All right, the beer batter is all mixed up and ready for the fish. Oh. First one going in. So we'll be placing the fish in 
tray in there to keep warm while the rest of the dinner comes together. Back of the temperature. I think we're about done. If it gets too cold, it'll get really greasy. So we want it to stay hot? Mm -hmm. Not getting really golden brown, which is I mean, about 360 right now. I think we're doing okay. Okay, our first one's coming out. It's crispy. Think it looks done? We just took the last fish out here. We're gonna put the potatoes back into the oil no. to finish browning them. Right, Nate? Yep. Exactly. About half at a time, I think, this time. There they go. All right, and Nate's gonna plate our dinner. Yeah. We have the chips. Hash look like that. Hashtag fries. British fries. They look exactly like French fries. Just so you know, we have to eat everything with our forks today. Because British oh. people eat everything with their forks. I'm embarrassed. She's crazy. Just so you know. Okay, there are the chips. And here comes the fish. Oh. Are you excited yet? Yeah. No, it's not the fries. I want this plate. <laughs> this plate. Are they crispy? Mixed us up a little bit of tartar sauce for our fish. What do you guys think so far? Uh, Have you tried the fish yet? Who's gonna be the first one? Dad already did. Oh, you did? How is it? Good. The breading isn't exactly flaky, but it's good. And the facts are fun! England's most popular person is William Shakespeare. Most popular sport is cricket, followed by football, also known as soccer. U.S. just beat England in Women's World Cup. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Most famous soccer player is David Beckham. Their best exports are machinery, vehicles, and gyms. Population is 55.62 million. Their currency is the pound. And those are the fun facts. We, we hope you enjoyed them. Okay, so now we're gonna make our raspberry coolie for our dessert. Knocker, knickerbocker, knickerbocker. Knickerbocker. Glory. Glory. So go ahead and throw the raspberries in there. All of them. Just don't put the paper in there. Oh, paper, there's a paper. Just kind of. Rake them in there with your fingers. <laughs> okay, so then you're gonna put two tablespoons of sugar. That's so loud. One. Just pour it in there. Two. put half a teaspoon of lemon juice. So just put like a little bit of dash. We don't have lemon juice, so we're gonna use lime, which will work just the same. Just a quick dash. 
That's not fun. Let's see. You put any in yet? Mm -hmm. A little bit more. There you go. Okay, and then you're just gonna stir it all up. Okay, and then you just stir until the sugar's dissolved, okay? So until you can't see it? Yep, and it says it should take about five minutes. We'll check in on you at 737. Awesome, as you can see, it's coming into a sauce. So after this, we put it through the food processor and then strain out the seeds. We're making some tea in the background. Yeah, Nate's making some tea. Here's Hayden's H mug with some hot tea. Two lumps of sugar and some cream or milk. 37. Pretty good. You think it's ready to put in the food processor? Yep. To make the Knickerbacker Glories, we have our homemade whipped cream, our raspberry coolie, some vanilla ice cream, and some strawberry ice cream. And you just layer them together in the tall glasses, and it's a nice snack. So we're going to do a little bit of vanilla in each. All right, and then we'll do a little bit of a whipped cream dollop. And we keep layering and layering. And it tastes really good. Okay. And that's pretty much it. A little bit of raspberry coolie. Yeah. Just a little. I don't really like raspberry a lot. Hayden thinks she doesn't like anything made with jelly. I or Hate jelly. Put a little on mine. Just a little. This your little one? So first layer, Hayden's gonna go ahead and finish these up for us. What are you hoping for? I think something Asian, maybe Indian. I don't know. We'll see. What if you get Scotland? Can we do all of the countries in the UK area? China. China, what are we gonna China, make? China, China, frogs. No. Oh, snails. No. Oh, that would be French. Okay, the kids are taking their first bites. What do you think? It's okay. All right, as you can see, Travis made a costume change. We're going to head out to his baseball game and wrap this up. And it's at 8.30. I hope you guys enjoyed our video. Please subscribe. Comment down below. Would you eat this? Yeah. Give us a big thumbs up. And we'll see you guys back at the house. Bye. Peace.